What's going on everybody? Coach Brian Kopacki here at CriticalBench.com. Are you sick of having belly fat and can't do a lot of core exercises? But you can. Planks. Planks are the greatest thing if you have too much body fat, especially on your midsection. So planking will help build your deep core muscles that lay, will, will lay the groundwork for that six pack that you, you're hoping to get. So as your stomach muscles become stronger, your midsection will tighten and you'll actually be stronger and look a little leaner too because everything's shrinking and tightening up. But keep in mind, however, that if you, if you wanna get that six pack, you gotta shed that fat and we'll talk about that in just a second. So if you have a large amount of belly fat on the midsection and also on the sides and lower back, you might be suffering from lower back pain as a result of the weight pulling you forward, uh, pulling and stretching out those erector muscles, kind of leaning in that hunched forward position from that weight. So planks work for back pain because they help strengthen your core. The side effect of that is reduced back pain, which is what you're looking for. So they also strengthen your back muscles, your upper shoulders, your arms, but also your hips too which is important for uh, controlling back pain. So because the plank exercise requires minimal movement, so you're, you're actually contracting all your muscles without moving, which is great because if you have back pain, you don't wanna move, especially doing a crunch or a sit up, which is definitely a no-no. So I'm about to show you three moves that are great for those who have back pain and maybe a little bit of too much belly fat that they, again, they can't do like a sit up or a crunch, and you shouldn't even do those anyways. But anyway, you, you wanna be doing these three exercises to start out by training the core. So the first one is doing a plank, but from a kneeling position. The second one is an elbow plank or your traditional front plank. And the third being a side plank, but we're gonna be doing something a little different with my, my feet. My legs are gonna be stacked or staggered, and I'm also gonna be bracing myself with my opposite hand. So the plank on the knees is simply that, just doing a plank from a kneeling position, a lot of your weight is not being uh, distributed through the elbows and, and feet. It's actually most of it's on the knees. Will it help your back pain. The elbow plank is just a traditional plank. Your hips, hips are elevated, knees are elevated. This is a little more taxing on the body, but it's the step above doing a plank from the kneeling position. The third one being that stack leg or that staggered leg side plank, where you can see my hand here is pushing on the floor to help stabilize. This gets the, the obliques and also a little bit of the back muscles. So also, like I said about the diet, controlling your diet is a significant part about losing that belly fat. So this is most effective by reducing the number of uh, calories you're taking in each day, burning more calories each day, but also staggering out your meals throughout the day that you're able to keep a steady, a steady metabolism, um, you're just keeping a steady flow of, of calorie burning throughout the day. So you wanna be eating things like lean proteins, green leafy vegetables, stay away from processed foods, sugary foods, soda, alcohol, things like that. But so if you're, if you're looking to shed that belly fat, incorporate planks and also a little bit of uh, good eating, that'll go a long way. Don't forget to drink water too. This is also gonna help out flush all the toxins from your body. So there's more information I'd love to share with you. It's in this report right here. It's the death of crunches and sit-ups. Click the link, give us your email, we'll send you a copy of this awesome report right away. If you can't click it because you're on a mobile device, what you need to, need to do is uh, click the little arrow under this video. That's gonna open up the video description. That top link, criticalbench.com slash YouTube2 is the link you need to click to get this awesome report. We appreciate you watching. Subscribe to our channel, check out our other videos. Like us, share us, but also leave us some comments or feedback below. Love to hear from you. Have a good day, see you soon.